Hi there! Are you new to Skype? Follow me to learn all about important features and thus to make the most of Skype. Once you launch Skype, enter your username and password to log in. The left pane shows you the list of contacts. You can edit your profile information by going to the Profile tab. You can set an image saved on your computer as your profile picture. You can also change your Skype display name and contact information on the same page. If you have subscribed to Skype, then you can use various features like making free calls to anyone on Skype. If you have a webcam, you can also make video calls. You can chat with people by instant messages. You can make paid phone calls from Skype to a phone. Besides this, you can make a group video call to multiple friends. You can get a Skype to go number that lets you make international calls using a phone while avoiding international calling charges. You can set a voicemail so that you don't miss any call on Skype. Of course, you can use Skype to send SMS and forward calls. The online number feature lets your friends and family call a number from their phones at local rates that you can answer to using Skype. Changing your availability status is really easy in Skype. You can make a test call to sound test service to check the call and sound quality. While on a call, you can mute or unmute your microphone, send files and contacts, and even add people to the call. You can click on the disconnect button to end the call. To send an instant message to a friend, simply click the name and type the message in the IM box. By using the add a contact feature, you can easily add more friends to the contact list. You can also group common friends together so that it's easier to start group chats and calls. You can view recent conversation history under the recent tab. If you want to customize Skype to make it work better for you, click on Tools and go to Options. This opens a window where you can change various settings related to sound, privacy, etc. You can block unwanted people in your friend list or unblock friends that you have blocked before. The next option lets you customize notifications and alerts. You can change call settings like forwarding calls, setting voice messages, and adjusting video settings. In addition to all this, the Options panel lets you change IM, SMS, and advanced settings. Wasn't that quick and easy? To get more such tips, subscribe to our YouTube channel. Click on the button above. Thanks for watching.